Sanel, je ne sais pas si tu es un homme. Je ne sais pas si tu es un homme. Je ne sais pas. Tu sais? Tu sais? Tu as écrit depuis longtemps. Je ne serais pas surpris si tu as écrit un livre. Je ne sais pas si tu es un homme. Quelque chose. Quelque chose. Kasi kasi, au chingwa nugu chwenza ni la posta nele. Ah ah, no koko, I'm great. Uraiti ilimtelu sisi sana la tumfunu bona mta benga sisi. Sana, bala malai. What did you do? I will not write on walls again, and vandalism is not rock art. Ya is gefang omra te graffiti gedine. Guys, it's not a big deal. Sana, vandalism is a big deal. You are defacing school property. Hoeveel lijn net al veel gegeven om uit te schrijven? A thousand weer. Ja, dan is dit een groot story. Hoe is het in? You can't go around writing on school walls. That is disrespectful and food you're making the school to look untidy. You know, I absolutely hate it when people scratch on the desk like this. At my school, if you're caught doing that, they make you sand the desk. Yeah, they should. Why are you not going to get a lot of money? I'm not going to get a lot of money. I'm not going to get a lot of money. Yeah, and I was just doodling. Well, you're lucky you didn't get into detention. Sanele, there's a time and place for doodling. Writing on school walls and walls is unacceptable. I've seen the most graffiti in this town. It's like a 3D graffiti. Nana Dozibona, I went past the same wall and saw these lame scribbles. But the next day when I came, I saw this awesome picture. Yeah, I saw it too, but I'm not that good. You got to go to the practice of the EPP, not on school walls and walls. I hope you have a good word to write. No way, I just wrote the school song. Yeah, but the time is to write a lot of ungeschikt. I want to do this nice anti-animal abuse message once. I have a lot of good words to write in the regering. But I don't have a regering in this message. Guys, we have long passed the era of rock messages. If there's a message you want to pass on, just find another way of doing it. Rock art was a way to pass messages, and not just art. Yeah, most art is a form of passing messages. Ek het gedoog is net vir die versierings. Rock art is the earliest form of communication after languages, of course. Ah. So, Coco, you tell me that they used rock art to just pass messages. Rock art was used as a form of communication, and then they preserved it as a book. Why didn't they just write a book then? Because Carlos was cut, writing had not yet been invented, only drawing. It's hard to think about how to think about a script. Yeah, but people are inventive, Vian. They found other ways. I guess it's over to the Wonder Room, then. Let's go to the Wonder Room. Okay. Do a damn thing in every way. Open up and take a step. Open up and take a step. Let's think back before the times of technology and post office and writing. What do you think? How people used to communicate? I know. They'd use their voice to shout or talk and they'd use their bodies to show shine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. They would use their voices to say many things. But let's talk about science a bit. Oh, like science for the deaf? No, no, no. That, not that kind of science. Oh. Oh. Kulman is sign language they understand of everybody. Like this one. You were saying sharp. Okay. Oh, okay, all right, so. Right, you see? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. What other signs can you show me that you guys know that everybody understands and anybody know, all of us know? When you wave, you say hello. 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 Call me. Call me. Or peace. Or peace, or. Come, come. Yeah. Or oh. oh. listen. 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 Shh. Or. Oh. Go, go. You drink. drink. <laughs> oh. Mm. Or sleep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is money. Hey, you like money? money. <laughs> <laughs> yes, guys, signs go beyond languages. Even people who don't speak the same language, at least with signs, they can all understand the signs because they are known to all of us. Think about drumming, dancing, and symbols. All those were earlier forms of communication. Go, go. I understand the other ones, but dance is a form of communication. Dunk on ballet and elke dance vertel het a story. That's very true. That's a great example, Vian. Dance is a very important form of communication. Music and liek is it altijd boodskap in alle. 
Oh, like that wedding song, Coco, where we allow Umakoti to go We don't allow. It says Umakoti to peg. Oh, yeah. We're not. Jinjan, um... It's Umakoti to go away to see Vuma. Um, go away to Gempela, see ya, Vuma. Oh, yeah, Pimba. Um, go away to Vuma. You see well, you see well, you see Vuma. <laughs> and there's this one, our netty. But I let you hello, the pizza tail. Mungaton, I gave you a fishy. Hey, Musute. Yeah. <laughs> there are also lullabies like that song. Tula, 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 sana. Tula, mamu, zobona, ego, seni. Oh, you know it. Of sports creator, where the span is on the ground, and they are not up to the end. Yeah, no? Yeah. Or like the most famous song, Coco. Happy birthday. Okay. Like, happy, happy birthday, happy, happy birthday to you. <laughs> and they're still singing that happy birthday song song exactly. today, no? <laughs> Oh, like a love song, Coco. Like, and I, I will always love you. Always love you. <laughs> Coco, I never thought that all of these things were used as communication. Me neither. I would have called it art, but not mm. communication. But it's so that we all have new modern options. And Vian is right. Let's take a look at this video and hear what he has to say about communication. My name is Kia and I work at the Rock Art Research Institute in Johannesburg. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about rock art, but I'm also going to talk about the sort of symbols that rock art makes and the other sorts of symbols that people have used to communicate since the start of time. The big thing that separates humans from any other kind of animal in the animal kin kingdom is our ability to use symbols to speak to one another. But one of the symbols that has stayed and that we can understand today is rock art. A lot of the images in these paintings are very recognizable. You see things like Irland and Raybuck and Buck that we understand and know today. Rock art changed as people's lives changed into a site of protest. The next place I'm gonna take you to is a very different message. It's a message of oppression and fear, but ultimately it's a message of victory in the late 1800s as African people fought for their land and for their rights against people who had entered their space and were changing the way that they lived in their world and they did things in the world and the way they communicated messages to one another. When European settlers began to arrive and spread throughout South Africa, the way that rock art looked and the message that rock art held started to fundamentally change. Even though there was now writing and there were different ways to record history, nobody stopped making rock art. The people who made it changed and the message behind it changed, but rock art remained as a powerful way to tell a story. Here, where no Europeans could reach and where no one could find them, these stories got told and they got told through one of the oldest forms of communication available. It got told through rock art. And although it's not quite as pretty as the stuff we've seen, although it's not quite as neat and colourful, it tells a really powerful story and it holds a fundamental piece of history from the perspective of the people who lived it. The, the Makabeng shelter is a space that was a scene of conflict in the late 1800s. And this particularly is the advent of the Kruger Railway at about 1894 or so. We know that rock art stretches back about four or five thousand years into South Africa's past and it's continued on until the 1900s and although rock art has changed in the way it looks and who makes it, the message behind rock art has not. 
so rood kind of graffiti inspired. Yeah, we can say that. It's a good thing that there were cave drawings because now we know more about their life during that time. It's a clever way to write down mystery. And to tell a story. And all understand noch vandaag die symbole. Symbols are amazing. You can just tell by looking at the picture. I'm glad that you guys noticed because that leads us to our next challenge. So go collect the stop signs on the road. Uh-huh. Let's have a look on the screen. Do you know that sign? No, no dogs. No dogs. Okay. Let's see the next one. No fishing. No fishing. Ah, you guys are clever. Let's see the next one. No, no guns. guns. Whip, the next whip. one. Whip. No, no roller skating. Oh, the next one. No swimming. No swimming. The next one. No, no smoking. smoking. The next one. No, no food. No food. No. We don't eat. <laughs> the next one. No, no camera. Taking, taking pictures. Taking photos. Taking no photos. photos. The next one. No, no phone. cell phones. Phone. The next one. No, no fires. fires. Let's see if there's another one. This is the end. <laughs> okay. See how from those little pictures you got a message. Mm. Now I want us to play another game. Okay. Coco, is it written to Germany? Listen carefully. You're going to take one slip, you read it, okay. and then think carefully about it, put it in your pocket, and then you stand up. You don't make a sound, and you just show us the sign. Oh, it's a stomp strike. Naturally. Are we ready? Yeah. Let's go, go. So okay. who goes first? Yes. Yeah. Thank you, Coco. Uh -huh. okay, so. okay. You can take yours in the meantime. You can take yours in the meantime. Okay. <laughs> and read it. Mm. Uh, I have okay. 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 Put it in your pocket and think about it. Uh. Uh -huh. Are you ready? Yes, yes. Coco. Yes. Okay. Okay. Elephant. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now mine. Can I see it? I'm gonna have to see it actually, so I'm gonna do it here. Okay. Uh, He's dancing, tap dancing. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, now mine. Yes. Um a fish. Yes. Ah, <laughs> take another one. Okay. Take another uh, one, Vian. Think carefully okay. in the pocket. Put it in your pocket and then show us the sign when you're ready. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Is it easy? No, Coco. <laughs> Let's see. <clears throat> Picking up a box. Mm -mm. Delivery man. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Trolley. Mm -mm. I'm a car. Mm -mm. Digging. Spades. Mm -mm. um, uh, uh, gardener. A kraiwal. A kraiwal. Shovel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then. Mm -hmm. Loading. Loading stand mm -hmm. in a box. Mm -hmm. <laughs> in a I don't know. It's a kraiwal, mom. What's mm -hmm. the English one? Mm -hmm. In a wheelbarrow. Yes! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, mine. This is easy. Oh, yeah! No sound, you're disqualified uh, sound. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no sound. Okay. It's like this. A plane. A plane. A bird. Helicopter. Yes. <laughs> okay. 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 No sound, guys. Something. Mm. Planting. Mm -mm. Digging. Milking a cow. Milking. Ah! Mm -hmm. Milking. Mm -hmm. A goat. Mm -mm. A cow. Milk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <Milk>. Chicken. <laughs> mm -mm. Milk steak. Yes. <laughs> 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 Ballerina. Ballerina. Ah, uh, ballet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This one's quite easy. Jumping. No. 
bouncing. Yes. Okay. Think carefully, Mr. Milkshake. Oh, okay. Okay. Ooh. Hmm? Throat. Pick up. Pick up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Google, can I take another one? Because mine's the same as his. Okay. 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 So I'm gonna, just going to put that one there. Hmm. Uh, Don't make a sound. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A pig. <laughs> a bird. A clown. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> okay. okay. A chicken. Yeah. Guys, <laughs> <That is it. laughs> what do you think about this game? Do you understand it? Do you love it? Do you enjoy it? I enjoy oh, it. I love it. You love it? Mm -hmm. Very nice. Nice. I like acting out the different things. Yeah. yeah. And laughing. And talking with science is yeah. quite good, ne? Yes, yeah. Because you don't even use your voice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. I think this was quite a challenge. Let's go back to the other side so that Sanele can finish writing his lines. Mm. Okay. 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 Let's go back. Guys, I know exactly what we're going to make. A different type of rock art. This is a rot meat. Do we have a kid, Vian? <laughs> no, Vian. Go, go outside and get me five pebbles. Any pebbles? They're the ones in the walkway. The ones as big as mine. Okay. Okay, okay guys, I'm going to get the paint. Nina, you must just put newspapers on the table. Eh? Okay. okay. Put the go. newspapers. Here are the newspapers. Okay. And then go. Go, go. I'm back. Oh, I want to see how can this turn out. <sighs> Let me help in the meantime. Okay. Okay. Hey, here we go. Okay. You from Uganda? Go to the and I just want to see what you guys are going to do. Yo, Coco, I can't wait to see how it's going to be. Now I can't wait to see. Hey, Coco, you're supposed to tell us what we're going to do. Okay, okay, I will tell you. You just let your creative juices flow. Okay, I want you to paint on those pebbles. Now. You mm. can paint anything, a ladybug, a beetle, whatever pattern you want to paint on that rock. Just show me your creativity. What can I do with the fish here at the club? You can do anything. Use it as a paperweight, to decorate your room with it, give it away as a gift, whatever you want to really. Oh, Neda's Pesesa. So we can do anything with this rock. It just has to be finished and painted. And Paint. look beautiful. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There's the paint. Choose whatever color you want. And there are the brushes there. Oh, thank you, Gugu. Mm. Sanela, what color would you like to use? Uh, Coco Bengala, black and yellow. Black and yellow. Why? Favorite chiefs. <laughs> <laughs> no, Coco. I want to make a bee. Oh, okay. I thought so. Yeah. And Nana, yeah. what colors? I'm gonna have pink and white. Mm -hmm. And okay. I think it's a purple. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What colors? I'm gonna take blue, the green, and maybe the black. Also, I'm gonna use that. Okay. Okay. What are you going to paint on your rock? Can I draw a car? It's up to you. I don't know. You like cars. You love cars. <laughs> yes, Coco. When are you painting, my darling? I'm gonna paint a butterfly. But I love butterflies. <laughs> okay. Be careful, guys. No paint on your school uniforms, ne? Okay, sure. Let's borrow the yellow. Sure. Guys, Gucci Coco hasn't painted in a very long time. You? And this kind of painting is fun. All our colors.
I don't know what to play in a yellow yak. Oh, I go can you to sing with the little things I have. Are you, painting. Are you bleeding, Gogo? <laughs> <laughs> wow, I can really see your bee coming out, Sonele. Thank you. Nice mm. car, Vian. It's a big bee. <laughs> Look at Vian's car. It's a beautiful car. It's like it's a, a sports car. It's a Volkswagen. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, your butterfly is nice. nice. I like the colors. Nice. Thank you. It's a princess butterfly. Mm. So guys, you enjoy painting? I love paint. Cool. Cool. Playing with paint. Can I please yes. get the white sanelli? Oh, here you go. Thank you. Go, go. Sing a deal in the yam. So, Katil. Which is the white yam? Looks beautiful. Looks, Fun good, yeah. Looks beautiful. With your pencils, Valen. Oh, yeah, I think. Here's the blue lid here yeah, for the oh, paint. Oh, I think she is the using it. So, now we So, what's the name of your car? Epic Hangout. <laughs> Epic Car. Family Bus. Family <laughs> <laughs> Bus. <laughs> Guys. We really had fun painting our rocks here. I hope you also are doing so at home. And send them to us. Show us what you did. Send them on our email. Take pictures and send them to epichangout at sabc.co.za. Until we meet again next time, same place, we love you. <laughs>